Cola Blue and welcome! Today we're making some jewelry out of shrink plastic. Yes, we're trying the shrink plastic again. Because why not? But you know, since it was such a big failure last time, because we used reuse plastic, just some from fruit, I think, we just yeah went out and bought some some real string plastic, so we were sure it would work. And we were still really scared, because you know, you never know. Maybe it didn't work. And as you can see, my sister is drawing a flower, and I am making some fairy earrings and uh, a mermaid necklace. And let me say, I think it turned out pretty okay. I think my sister's was a lot prettier, but unfortunately that's a bit of a disaster and I'm going to tell you about it. So my sister made these really, really beautiful earrings and she went around just cleaning up after we had filmed or, you know, in between filming because we hadn't filmed all of it because we were waiting for it to dry and I don't know, it got lost and she looked for it for like an hour, on and off, couldn't find it, no matter where, so you're not actually gonna see the end result of the of the flower, but believe me, they were really pretty and amazing, pretty much, but that's just too bad, that's just life. Let's, let's hope they turn out up at some point, because I think she would really enjoy them, just having them in general. So, yeah. That's that strategy. Let's move on. Here I am just coloring in the the little fairy and it's kind of awkward because you can't really see anything. So you just can see at some point and it's gonna be colored. But it's hard because we're both right-handed. So it's like, what angle are you gonna film at if we need to get both of us in there? If you have any suggestions, please leave them down below. It's okay. I wouldn't mind hearing. I would also say that if you do the same as I, making some earrings, please just think about maybe coloring it, them in at the same time. Because this thing about coloring one in and then the other, that's, that's a terrible idea. <laughs> a really terrible idea. <laughs> it doesn't really work very well because then you have to remember everything you've done and you know, if you just do it one by one color instead of what I did, you know, it's a lot of e easier to make them even. But it doesn't really matter in the end because mine turned out super dark. You can barely see the color. Also, the mermaid turned out really dark, so I guess that just happens. I mean, this is my first time succeeding in spring plastic, so maybe I'll learn some more next time. And since we have more left, we can always make more. At least that my, that's my opinion, or thought, or whatever. And here we are, just coloring in. So cozy. I actually designed some or other mermaids, because, yeah. <laughs> I wasn't sure what kind I wanted, if it had to be someone swimming, or... Yeah, the one sitting, but I end up just making the one sitting. And I think, I think they all in, turn out really, pretty good, actually. And my sister has cut out the plastic just to make it easier to turn it around while she's coloring it in. To make it easier for her, yay! <laughs> and if you have a hard time finding out what kind of thing you want to make, you can just always go online and find a stencil or some inspiration, stuff like that. At least I think that's a good idea. And this particularly kind of string plastic. It was kind of hard to draw with with a with a pen. And it also said you had to use colored pencils, but if you used the color pencil first and then the pens afterwards, it wasn't it was good enough. It it turned out good. At least I think so. But of course, you can always give your opinion on how it turns out. I mean, as long as you're nice. I don't like people who aren't nice. That's just life. I don't think anyone does. <laughs> Here I am, still coloring, and my sister's still coloring the 
tragic creature <laughs> and we're gonna cut him out and I think we're actually cut in a second because I don't think it would be interesting for you to watch us cut it out yeah so here we are that's the finished result as you can see they turned out really dark I added some glitter just to make him a little lighter and we're just showing them off that's all for now bye